off gate one in red. The Amber Oak gate two in yellow. Schmarsvik gate three blue. The Guta gate four in white. Can anyone beat the world champion here this afternoon? This is going to be a... Warshaw retake the lead. Could Lublin take the lead for the first time since heat six? I reckon this could go all the way, you know, this meeting. I think we could be going to the last heat decider. Plenty to go before that though. Holder, Yambro, Schnarsnik and Laguta. Heat number nine gets underway. Now it's the first turn. Decent start by the Gorshaw pairing. Schnarsnik will lead the rider in white out wide. Grigory Laguta on the first turn. His teammate Jack Holder's there on the inside. Now this pairing already have got a 5-1 in heat seven. And they're out in front once again. Laguta got pushed wide there by the man in blue, Bartosz Schnarsnik. He's at the back. So Schnarsnik knew exactly what he had to do there on the first turn to deal with the threat of Grigory Laguta. He's at the back behind Jakub Yamro. This is critical. Every point is critical for Stel Gorchov. They are determined to get their first league win of the season. Laguta's come through in the third place, past his teammate Jakub Yamro, now attacking Jack Holder. Marsnik needs to look behind him here and maybe ease off just a little to try and help Jack Holder hold that second place. We know Laguta is coming. It's going to be an interesting finish here because Laguta's got to run on the inside out of turn two. Look out, Jack Holder, he's going to try for a last spin lunge up the inside here. Holder locks up a little, here comes Laguta on the inside, bashing to the side of Holder. Holder's down. Oh, controversy there. Look out, Start Marshall. My goodness me. Now, there's going to be a lot of controversy there. Because it certainly looked to me as though uh, Laguta lunged in and brought Jack Holder down there. We hope Jack's OK. Certainly the opinion of uh, one Stel Gorchov fan is being made known there. Oh, the home fans are furious. Laguta coming over to see if Jack Holder's OK. Now, let's see what the referee says about uh, that one. Gata Schmarslik takes the win. Wait and see what the result set is of that one. It's good to see Laguta is there checking on Jack Holder. Let's hope Jack is all right. Now, the result did come up on the screen briefly as a 4-2. We'll wait and see what the referee says. Holder had locked up. Oh, he got some lift there off the inside. He hit a patch of grip. So that, I don't think, was intentional by Grigory Laguta. Straight into the side of uh, Jack Holder. George Marsnik looking for him on the final turn. There's the contact. Down went Holder and into the fence. And there's no air fence on that bit of the track either. The bike did cross the line in fourth place. So he just straightened up. He got some grip through turn four. Into Holder's front wheel. Down he went. I certainly don't think that was intentional there. But uh, we'll wait and see what referee Mikhail Sassian says here. Cheers from the home fans there to Grigory Laguta. They're certainly not happy. The result has not uh, come through to me yet. We saw the score flash up as 28-26, indicating a 4-2, but that was just as the riders crossed the line, because Laguta did get over the line. So I don't think the result um, has been officially declared of that one yet. still showing us 24-24. A yellow card is given to Grigory Laguta for unsafe riding. And we're told he has been excluded. Yes, 29-25 goes